Hi everyone, this is Dwight Braswell, also known as Coach D. And several years ago, I started posting quotes online to help encourage people. And the theme was to help you keep going, to charge ahead through any obstacle, not knowing that one day we'd be in this crazy situation with a pandemic, a, a global pandemic. And what we need now more than ever is encouragement to help encourage not only others but to encourage ourselves and so uh, just recently I've, I've started to compile all the the best quotes the quotes that you have responded to the most and I've created a daily journal called keep going 365 and it basically is you know in times like this we need to sit back and reflect it gives us an incredible opportunity to just not go a thousand miles per hour but to sit back and think what does all of this mean to me and what can i do to be stronger on the other side of this because no matter what we are going to get through this right so what i'd like to do is i'll be releasing that soon it's a daily journal that you can write out all your thoughts all your feelings etc but i'd also like to create and provide you with just daily videos um, of me just going through the quote you know talking about what it means to me and then inviting you to to share if you want to share it in your own daily journal that's fine or if you want to you know share it with our community through comments or anything else that's that's totally fine you can join the conversation but it's really about you're not alone but let's do this together. I don't care how far apart we are. We are separated to actually help each other. But what we've realized throughout this entire pandemic is that across the globe, we are connected and we can keep going no matter what. So in our first video, today's day one of 365. Over the next year, I'm just going to come on for a couple minutes, share a quick quote, and then if you want to follow along, you absolutely can. I'll post the quote in the comments, and then if you want to share some things that you're thinking about with this, awesome. So let's get started. This is one of my favorites. Uh, it goes like this. They weren't surprised when you stumbled. They weren't surprised when you failed. Yet they will be surprised when you get back up, when you get up and stand taller than you ever have before. Man, you know, I don't even care if it's somebody that you're thinking about when you, when you read this or if it's this pandemic. The coronavirus knows that it's, it's gonna knock you down. It knows that it's gonna make you fail. You might lose a job, you might lose an opportunity, you might be knocked out, but it has no idea how powerful you are that no matter what, through this, you're only gonna get stronger. You're only going to be better on the other side because of this. And this virus or that person or whatever it is, the thing that you're thinking about had no idea that on the other side, what they did, what this virus is doing to us is only going to make us stronger. That's the kind of thing that I write in my journal. When I created Bunny to Bear, my first company, Bunny to Bear, I was helping people go from a, a place of fear, of doubt, of uncertainty to a place of courage, of confidence and conviction. And what I found is that, you know, like the Oprahs of the world or the, you know, the, the most successful people had these bear moments. A bear moment is when you can think of that time when someone did something so bad to you, whether they counted you out, whether they said something crazy to you, whether they acted on you over and over, whether this virus, whatever it was, there was a bare moment that said, you know what? Because of that, I'm going to work harder. I'm going to push strong. I'm going to push past. I'm going to charge ahead just because of this. So write down in your journal, what is that bare moment? What is that thing that is causing you or is going to start causing you to push harder, to push stronger, to push and to stand up stronger? and to stand taller than you ever have before. I can't wait to hear about it. Look, be an encourager. 
not only for others, but for yourself. We'll see you tomorrow. This is Keep Going 365. See ya.